Japanese Americans to be treated differently from German Americans and Italian Americans? Why are we comparing them to German and Italian Americans? Those are the other enemies, quote unquote, who we're at war with. <coughs> Even though we were at war with them, because some members of the military feared that the Japanese Americans living on the West Coast would sabotage military installations. <laughs> oh, terrible. The military rights. Despite strong protests by the Attorney General, the government authorized extensive searches of private residences and businesses for anything that might be considered contraband. The homes of both Japanese immigrants and Japanese American citizens were searched, often in the middle of the night. As Monica Sohn describes, few personal possessions were considered above suspicion. The presence of cameras or radios, Japanese newspapers, books or magazines, <coughs> or the total absence of such objects. Um, made ordinary families the object of further government surveillance. Those who failed to answer the questions to the authorities' satisfaction could be detained for further questioning. This time of search and seizure, painful as it was, was only a prelude to the more extensive violation of rights that members of the Japanese community experienced as the war continued. They found themselves subject to verbal and physical abuse. Their homes and businesses were vandalized and sometimes destroyed. When the military asked them to move to areas further inland, they were abused and threatened by citizens in the inland areas. Understandably, only a small number of Japanese Americans volunteered for the program. Thus, the military then asked President Roosevelt to begin a forced evacuation. Mm. We will learn more about this force evacuation and internment next. Okay? All that information was taken from that book that's listed there. All right. So that is background. So all of a sudden, a hatred, a fear, a distrust of Japanese Americans. It wasn't all of a sudden. This had been coming the end of the 1800s. They were slowly starting to limit Asian immigration, whether it be Chinese or Japanese immigration. So this wasn't something new, and it was very, very prevalent in California, because that's when most Japanese Americans settled, if they didn't settle in Hawaii. The majority of Japanese immigrants did actually live on the Hawaiian, in the Hawaiian Islands, not on the West Coast, but many did come to the West Coast. And they were really successful here in the industries that we talked about, mining, canning, agriculture, uh, small businesses. Uh, that served their own community and uh, laundry services and things like that to serve the white community. Okay. So what we need to do is actually read about the forced internment, so the forced evacuation. So um, actually I want to show you, see if you can click on the video and watch it on your own. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. If you go video, this is the enemy. Video. Yeah. Oh, I got it. Yeah. <laughs> Please click on the video and watch the video. This is the enemy. I'm still on. It's just hidden. Like a ninja. <laughs> like a ninja. Wait, wait, the one, the video ran right underneath it? Japanese yes. internment of WMD. Go ahead. Quiet down now, kid. Hi, Zach. No. Other way. This is the enemy. I don't remark his face. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. Volume. Oh, it, it's the video, Jordan. Jordan, come be on camera. Where's Jordan? Jordan. Oh, that's Jordan, come be on video. No, nope, Mac. 
Yeah, oh, no, no Kone. No. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> Jordan! Jordan! Wait, wait, what? That's Jordan. No, it's working. Smite the more that one because then you don't see it. It's Connor. Connor's out of YouTube. <laughs> Stephanie. <laughs> Stephanie. Say hi. Hi. Oh. Who's saying hi to you? A computer? Yeah, you weirdo. <laughs> what are you doing? What is what are you guys the video on? Video's on. It's on. Do that. And at the solicitation of Japan, was still in conversation with its government and its emperor, looking toward the maintenance of peace in the Pacific. Look at them. Let's see your computer. That's what we're watching right now. What are you talking about? Peter. YouTube. 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 Say hi to YouTube. Look how cute this guy is right here. You got a cast. It's Kevin. He has on my cast. <laughs> Do a channel all the way over there. It's like rising stones. Tanner right there. Are done with the video. Move on to the Jack, you're next. Yeah. Tanner! Go on webcam. This is the enemy. I make a You do not have to Yeah. But as long as it's this way, it's both. Yeah, oh. oh. video. It really is. What? There's there's stuff to it. When you're done with the video, go to the next item. I believe it's the next one. Upon four essential human freedom. Freedom. And click on Japanese American Yeah. Freedom of speech and expression. Everywhere in the world. You will be Second, the answer freedom of directly attacked by naval and air forces of the Empire of Japan. Yeah, wait, what just happened? The United States was at peace with that nation. Uh, put your, put your and um, at the solicitation of Japan, bad. Bad. was still in conversation it. with its government and its emperor, it. looking it. toward the maintenance of peace in the Pacific. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I forgot how to do this. Space boost. Fuck. <laughs> Again, when you are done with the video, you need to go on to the thing called Japanese American Tournament. It will take you to a website to answer any questions about the website. So, Oh, shit, it was playing it again. This is nice.